Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. In September 1902, Natchez baseball fans rode the trolley out to Old Concord Park to watch the Natchez Indians clinch the first ever Cotton States League championship in extra innings. The Cotton States League ran from 1902 to 1908 as a Class D league, and Natchez fielded the Indians in the 1902 and 1903 seasons, followed by the Natchez Hill Climbers in 1904 and 1905. A Baton Rouge newspaper noted the Indians were fast fielders, good hitters, and proved hardy base runners. They were in good shape and played a scientific game. The Natchez Democrat offered some advice to the fans and spectators of Natchez baseball. The way to get work out of any ball club is to encourage the players by your presence and with your applause, and that applause should be given the visitors just as liberally as the homeboys, especially if the play made is an extra good one. People go to see good ball playing, the paper noted and therefore, good play should be applauded. The Cotton States League shut down in 1908, but was revived four more times with Natchez once again fielding a team known as the Indians from 1948 to 1953. In addition to the Cotton States League, Natchez was also represented in the Evangeline Baseball League, a six-team Class D minor league that began in 1934. This league was composed primarily of Louisiana teams. The Natchez Pilgrims debuted in 1941, followed by the Natchez Giants in 1942, and in 1946 and 1947. Hi, I'm Jared Hoffbauer, former major leaguer and currently the head baseball coach at Delta Charter School, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.